live fashion show coming to you soon. Hey my little angels and welcome back to another video you guys. So first of all, before we get started, I wanted to let you guys know that me and Vax, we're gonna be hosting a live fashion show, live TFF fashion show, but it will be fair for everyone. You will get to use the dressing command. You will do not, you do not need to have shop items in order to participate in this. All you need is your sense of fashion and to be there. So we're going to try this out for once. It will take a lot longer than usual and it'll take a lot longer to judge because we had to enter codes in to look at everyone's outfits. So you'll have to bear with us. But that is a cost you're going to have to pay in order to be able to get to participate using dress room and not just the shop. So we want to try this out. This could be the first time in TFM history that we're going to do this. We are planning everything out with all the rules and all and we have a discord made and we can like invite you guys there too. We'll try it out once and if it works very well. If it doesn't get too chaotic, we can make it like a every like two week thing or something like that. And the prize is a fur, by the way. You'll get your usual like fur prizes and all that stuff provided by fax. And then basically, if this works out very well, that'll be amazing. I'll live stream the first time, like parts of it at least. Maybe not including some of the judging and all that because it's, or maybe I might, we'll see about that because we will have to comment on a lot of the outfits and be like, this part's not that great or this was a lot better because we had to decide we had to eliminate, so we have to actually talk about that kind of stuff, obviously. Anyways, so I'll get to that more of that later on. If you want more info on that, you can drop a comment below if you're interested in it. It's gonna be probably like the weekend after Fur comes out, so it's gonna be on 25th of July for the first one, which will be around, I'm not sure what time did we say? What's it gonna be like? I don't remember the timing that we talked about, honestly. I think it was gonna be like 12 p.m. E PST or 3 p.m. EST, Eastern Standard Time, something like that. But we are, we're figuring out the details. We have all the rules and everything listed out, but as we think of more, we'll do that. But yes, do be excited and be aware for that, to be aware for that. Because I was thinking I was gonna host it on my YouTube channel, something like this, with using the dressing command, but it would become way, way too much with how many people would enter and all that. So anyways, this is a way for those of you guys who do not have items, for you to win them. So I was so excited. I really wanted to do this for a long time, but obviously I did not have the capabilities of the prizes of having like for prizes and stuff. So thanks Fax for being able to do that now. Anyways, let's get right on into this video. By the ways, I have already recorded this whole entire video. It turned out to be a 17 minute video. So I'm crying because the voice did not get recorded. So now my voice sounds a bit weird and scratchy. <laughs> I drank some water, but still. I spoke way too much at once, <laughs> so I know my voice sounds a bit weird now. Anyway, so this is such a cute drawing, Tara, huh? <laughs> and thank you so much. This is those live TF and fashion shows, but you do need to use your shop items. That's what happened in this fashion show, as most live fashion shows go on TFM. So thank you so much. So super sweet of you. Super, super sweet. <laughs> so anyways, we have these items that are coming to store. There is no flyer or banner. And I already showed all these items like two weeks ago or something. Actually, no, over a week ago, I mean. So you have these items. It's called Summer Lemon, this whole set. There are only four items. One, two, three, four. There are only four things here, so eh. But there's not a whole lot of items. I had added it up in the previous video I recorded. It came out to 360 total phrase for all of this. So it's a little less than a collector fur. So, I mean, I don't, I'm not sure what they're going, where they're going with it, but that's nice. You don't have to spend too much if you want to get all the stuff. You have to spend less than a typical fur, which is now in the days. And then you have this visor cap. And these are the people they credit to. Yep, yep, yep. And then, oh, this is like the lemon set. It's the summer lemon, so it goes very well with the lemonade fur. So, Fax actually made an outfit. Okay, this is just mine. Um, Let me go down. Where are they? Am I blind? Okay, there it is. So they made it with a lemon fur. It's the lemonade fur, so it looks pretty similar. It matches up very well together, just to let you know. Um, okay, so it matches up very well together, and then we have to go to announcements. So they talked about having a, there's no more more cooldown in tribe houses and modules. So they fix that, so it's not as annoying, so now you can mort without the cooldown, so that's awesome. They fix some vanilla rotations, bugs fixed cosmetics, view internal updates, okay, okay, okay. I think we're done with that. Oh yeah, I was going to talk to you also about how 
those new items that I've mentioned these things I showed it in my posts and stuff in case you didn't know I also put them into posts oh, okay just be quiet <laughs> so you can go to community and over here it shows you all the different posts and stuff that I made so I showed anything if they talk about like any different glitches or something that comes out or anything that's coming out in the future and all the guesses and sales and stuff like that and if there are events and all so I mentioned all that <laughs> and like how this change was made that time so just spoke about that so all that stuff all that good stuff so for now as you can see over a week ago it's like two days before this even came out I mentioned this and if you click on this because it's really small here shows you the full image which you can right click and then you can open image in a new tab and then when you go to that tab as you can see it's a lot bigger and you can make it even more bigger so if you want to see something in more detail so you can do that too oh they ruined the quality <laughs> on Photoshop the quality was amazing but anyways as you can see you can make it bigger so here's your summer lemon whole set so they only had these items but I did mention it in advance so that way you could decide oh the nighttime that nighttime box set thing that went away yes a day before like usually it goes away like yesterday night is when it should have gone away maybe but it went a day before that I don't know why but anyways okay we had to go back I forgot I was on that page so all right so I won't be doing this very often because anyways on Thursday which is today I will be talking about all these outfits oh and there are sales too the sales that came out this is really really cute totally worth getting but as you can see this sale item did change I'll tell you about that in later on videos so there's your burger mouth item and let's see the burger mouth item changed so you don't have that now and then we have the sweets so I just mentioned how outfits will now be released on Tuesday and there are three outfits this week because there was a tie for which ones to display and there, there was a skull beast for a giveaway at the time when I posted this in the official TFM server and it did have seven winners it lasted a day so it's over now but I do mention stuff like that too if it comes up and so you have this whole set and let's get right on people left you can say I, I spoke too much again <laughs> some people left I think <laughs> okay <laughs> they're still here waiting to say hi oh so sweet let's zoom in <laughs> let's zoom in so you guys can say hi and talk okay I think this would be too much zoomed in if I did that oh no perfect you guys everyone looks awesome and everyone looks very HD like <laughs> so cool so cool okay show sure. oh hello <laughs> hi there so that happens too okay there we go perfect Yo, everyone's HD now looking awesome show all <laughs> let's go to the shop now <laughs> so there's no banner for that by the way is when you first come in okay so first of all I'm gonna talk about the sales so this item changed as I showed you so after the update hap after like the collector update thing happens, usually one item or something changed. Last time the wool fur got changed to the Bambi fur, I think, or the deer fur was it it's called the Bam Bambi fur, I think. Either ways, I was so so sad about that that I was just like, no, I really wanted the wool fur, and I was I was about to win it too, but then it had to get changed. Anyways, this is the only item that got changed for this time. <laughs> And so then this is super cute. Oh, I'm so so sweet. They waited for like eight minutes while I was talking to be able to say hi to you guys. So sweet of them. <laughs> wow. Okay. I didn't realize I was talking for so long. It's already been 10 minutes now. I'm probably going to cut something out maybe here and there. Let's see. Anyways, so here's the balloon. This one, I'd say you should totally buy it. It's so worth buying if you do have the phrase for it. It's not a lot of phrase, that too. It's totally worth a whole set 20 phrase worth quest 20 phrase plus like you need 15 more so if you have that totally worth buying collector balloons used to be only 50 phrase before which are now a hundred phrase and these are amazing looking balloons this is one good set of balloons <laughs> compared to other balloons so I would totally get it if I were you and I could afford it this 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 okay but this is not worth 800 cheese that is a very basic fur which is also a permanent shop one by the way and you have all those new items so oh yeah I also wanted to mention you have all these boxes cool 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 and then you have the visor 
visor would look good for like a summery look you're on the beach or if you're one of those you know posh country club types tennis playing groups those kind of looks this will go very well with ponytails of any sort for the girls and for the guys i mean they're any hair that usually is more flattened down would look better on these just saying for the visors personally i don't use the visors a lot so i'm not sure how helpful it would be but this visor goes really well with this ascot dressing by the way you get to use this dressing command when we do our live transfer mice fashion show so you can use any items customize it anyway and submit your entries and it'll be live judging but it'll take longer because we have to enter each and every person's code to check their outfits okay this thing goes really really well with this neck item the ascot thing but it's also a collector so if you have it it's amazing it's, a, it's an amazing combo because it has these stripes and it has a stripe and like yeah it just goes perfectly well together so if you have it that's that's a good idea for combination and for hair too hairstyles so as i said down is it doesn't look that great okay i mean i'm not wearing the right things okay this short hair works basically anything that can give a sporty vibe short hair really works and you can have like that that short hair works too that works too for guys i don't know guys i'm not very in tune with that that can work no it doesn't work with that it works with this as well this one works really well and just like short hair mm, this one's okay more it shouldn't be oh it doesn't look that good in open hair honestly nope nope it doesn't work it, it's okay actually but yeah just those are my personal preferences in terms of which stuff works just some ideas and suggestions for you guys then you have these boxes and all that and by the way you should always check out like the ratio then that will tell you how worth it it is this is totally not worth it this would be like five cheese for one phrase so one phrase is only worth five cheese versus it can go up to one phrase being worth 20 cheese and more especially for furs and this is like totally worth it this, i'm just like yeah <laughs> okay and then let's go down oh yes i would show you the customizations of all these let's go and look at the customizations now I don't know if any of you guys don't have this dressing room app, I can show you how it can be customized if you wanted to customize. I can show you how it looks like and then you can decide if you want to customize it later on or not. You could try customization, but you have to buy the item to be able to see that. Oh no, wrong one. This is what I use when I make some fashion outfits. Okay, so we have our small box, which you can make bigger. And when I was recording the previous time, I didn't realize that you can move this thing around. I did not know that. Why did I not know that? And this is an umbrella. I did not know that was an umbrella either. There we go. And then you can have like totally black umbrella. So you can, oops, zero. See, that's like a black umbrella. I didn't realize it was an umbrella because the middle stripe thing matched up so much with the background. See, that's like a seashell. It's like pink. <laughs> that can be sand. So that can be like, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing here. Let's just make this water <laughs> but anyways as you, you get the idea same thing goes with a big box i won't do that i did that last time when i was recording but anyways as you can see same thing here planks you have your small plank too big you could always drag it around like that okay it's a little bit too big let's make it smaller okay there we go now it perfectly fits <laughs> okay so in this one as you can see the customizations you have this random line thing blue okay blue looks nice blue nice blue then ooh, let's make it purple this time <laughs> that can be made green oh no white looks better <laughs> this could be we'll make it green because why not and then these colors are actually nice in and of itself already so i wouldn't really want to change much Ooh, that's a nice purple <laughs> anyways that looks like a tropical fruit punchy thing i don't know <laughs> but as you can see that's how you can customize it same goes with the large plank you can just like drag it around and see it but you're gonna have to make it pretty small to see the whole thing at once as you can see the same thing here i'm not gonna do it again i already did it last time but there's no point so it's exactly the same thing so those are your items and how you can customize it and then last but not least let us talk about these fashion squad outfit looks oh by the ways before we finish doing that i did want to mention 
that the event, there was a vote, I think I talked about this last time, between the gardening event and the fishing event. The fishing event was outvoted. No, it was voted the most compared to the gardening event. So we will be having the fishing event next, which will come in on July 22nd. I did mention it in one of my posts as well. But yes, it will come in July 22nd, so be on the lookout for that. Time to get all your relics and everything. And yeah, I want to get that little sushi title. Like, I totally want that title. That's one of the titles I've been waiting for because I didn't realize it was actually part of the fishing set. I don't think I played much before. But either ways, I'll get it from the chest. Because I have a sushi outfit look, which is super cute, and that title will go perfectly with it. So I'm going to waste like all my tickets on that, on getting chests to try to get that. And meanwhile, you'll obviously have your four different prizes from this event, which is also going to be super fun. I don't see much point in me recording. I've already recorded this event before, but I'm probably going to record it again because why not? You could tell me in advance if there's anything you want to know specifically about the event that you want me to record and talk about. So I can do that too. Once the event's out, I mean, and give me like a couple days to record enough of the event maps and stuff to talk about it. Okay, so moving right along into these looks. So personally, my favorite out of all of these is this one. This is super cute. I love it. And it's like also simplistic. And let's start with this one. So I don't look at it by the whole outfit, honestly. I told you my favorite outfit. But overall, I look about the how important each item in the outfit is to me. If I were to buy it, how useful are each of those items? Because that's the whole point. You want to be able to use it with other outfits. That's why people usually buy it. And they buy it for the furs if they don't have the furs. I mean... But if you have the furs, then you look at the accessories and if they're worth it. This is a nice basic fur. It's white in color. If you don't have a white fur, there you go. It's a permanent shop one though, so it's not as, like, it's, it's something to be as excited over. Because a lot of people are waiting for any good collector furs to come back so that they can buy these outfits to get those furs. That's what a lot of people do. But overall, it's really nice. The ice cream, I wouldn't use it in any other looks, honestly. Personally, I don't think I've seen many people use it in many looks they made it look really good on this for in this outfit i mean but overall that and they're by the way these are shop you can buy it in shop you can buy this thing in shop so you can actually decrease the amount you have to pay like maybe you'll pay for the what do you call it the fur and you'd pay for the bubble gum which is the one of the best items on here this is like one bubble gum is like I'm like yes bubble gum would be a total want and this hair is also very useful so you'd be paying for the hair the bubble gum and the fur and that's it like, you wouldn't have to pay for these other things. These other things can be bought in shop. Oh, you would have to pay for the, obviously, for customizing. But see, sometimes they make it a bit cheaper. And by the way, if you don't want to buy it just then, and you're waiting for it to get even cheaper, another trick that I would use is you log on and log off. Or I don't know if it's timer-based or just when you whenever you log on again. But these sale things change around. See, this right now, this one thing is free. And then you have two things that are free over here. You'll always have some two items which are free, but the two items which will be free will switch around. So maybe you already have customization for this, but you don't have customization for this. And this one's free, but you already have it free, so it's not gonna make a difference. So don't buy it just yet. Wait for another day. Come not you don't have to wait for another day. You can just wait for another little bit of time. And then you will see like, oh, it'll change that this will become this will become 16 phrase, and then this will become 20 phrase, something like that. I mean, no, this will become free. This will become 20 phrase, but you already have it for free, so it will be free, and this will become for free instead. So like these, for the ones that they consider as free does switch around, so you can constantly come back and check. So that does happen, which is amazing, so that can help you out a bit as well. So just telling you tips on ways to save your phrase in these outfits. So moving on, this can be bought, like these are in shop. The these used to be used a lot like i don't know way way back when they were very popular now not that much you can get it it's a pretty decent item but it's okay this i haven't really seen it used much but that's cute how they used it like frosting that was creative so that's okay item my main thing this one has outvoted everything i'm like bubblegum is one of the highest voted sale things like it came in like third or fourth among the set that was over there but bubblegum is a pretty popular item so a lot of people are going to buy it for this i bet you that and this is a very useful item, especially if you can customize it. So that's a shop one, thankfully, so you can buy it with cheese. That's an item, useful item, as I said. This would be the second most useful one that I'd consider buying. Uh, this one has a lot more items, which would be more useful. But it has a lot more collector stuff, so you can't minimize it as much. 
let's go on to this one. So this is an inch store fur. You can make pretty good looks on this one. I haven't seen a lot of people using this fur. I have seen them use it before. This is also a pretty nifty item. So that's a collector one. This is not too useful if you want sort of like a magician-y type look or a cape type look. Or if you have the star wand, star shooting star ear item, or the star tail. If you want to pair it up with any of those, then you can do that. But overall, it's not too useful. In my opinion, I don't use it on many looks. This hair is in shorts in store, and it's very, very useful. I use it all the time for male looks. The tail, I don't think I've really used it much, so eh. But you can buy it in the store as well. These two you can buy in store. You can save 80 frays. That's totally worth saving 80 frays over. Then you have contacts. Eh. Don't really use them much. And this is also, if someone really wants to use the cotton candy, now you can buy your cotton candy item through this if you missed out on it, but personally I don't use it in many looks either, so that's why I put this as the third option to buy. But it depends on the stuff. If you really, you're like, yes, I really want this thing, or I really want this thing, then yes, then obviously go for it. That would be your number one choice. Just depends on which items you really want. So after that, this is the one that I'd say has the most useful ones because it has a collector fur involved in it. So if you missed out, you can get it now. But this was just, this just came out this past Easter, so it's not too useful. But, okay, I mean, in the sense that more people would have bought it because it's a lot more recent. So that's there, but it is a cute fur and it would make a lot of cute looks. I love how they color coded this. And this head item works perfectly with this fur too. So if you were to get the head item, you'd be like, what can I pair it with? You can totally pair it with this fur amazingly well. So that is also really great. That's also a collector and totally worth it if you want to combine these two. It looks really nice together. These earrings are one of the ones I was like, yes, this is a very lovely item. It goes very well with so many looks. I love this ear item, so that's why it was a yes for me. This it was a yes for me. I'm watching too much America's Got Talent. <laughs> okay, so this chocolate item, which is in store, you can buy it, but I don't get the point of customizing it. It's already blue. It's already dark enough. It's already like brown enough, like chocolate should be. So I don't, I don't see why they had to customize it, but okay, there goes some phrase. Bye bye. <laughs> and then you have this ascot, which is very useful and very versatile in so many different looks. Totally useful to get. And this hair is also pretty good too. It looks so good underneath that as well. They paired the hair with that thing up so well. And the eyes, chocolate eyes, they look lovely. <laughs> These eyes are always really nice and really cute. So overall, this one would be the number one that I would be interested in. But since I love the gum more, I would probably vote this as my number one. And you can decrease the price of the phrase by buying the store items too. But remember, the minimum amount of phrase that you have to buy is 100. So even if the whole look, if this whole look costs less than 100, they'll add some more phrase onto here to make this whole outfit cost 100 phrase. It will never go below 100. Just letting you guys know in case you didn't realize it. So there's that. And I spoke 24 minutes. Oh my goodness. This is even longer than the last video. Oh no. But anyways, I think I've covered everything I wanted to talk about. Yeah, so let me know if you have any other questions below. I gave you a lot of information in this video and my personal opinions. Because also, also like in general, TFM Discord, there are people who are asking me, when's the video coming out? I wanted your opinion on this and that. So that's why I'm including my opinions on these. Because apparently it helps you guys and that makes me feel so honored <laughs> that you guys actually care about the opinions that I have to share and yeah so be on the lookout and do let me know below if you're interested to join in the live transformized fashion show anyone can join because you we are going to use dressing command so you guys can make outfits in dressing so you just do slash dressing and boom you can use you have everything at your disposal all collectors all customizations everything so have fun and go crazy Oh yes, and another thing I did want to mention, I have had a, I haven't had a soulmate in so long and I finally <laughs> have a soulmate now. Like, yeah. But anyways, I did not realize it when you open like the friends list tab thing up top, their name comes at the very top and it's like with roses and stuff. Wait, let me just show you. I didn't realize this. Like at the very top it has these roses and stuff too. That's that's super cool. <laughs> I did not realize that. So, I was soulmate after such a long time. Yay. <laughs> And they're not even in the tribe house on my screen. That is so weird. Yet it still said that they were in the tribe house. <laughs> so funny. Anyways, that's pretty much it for this video, guys. Ooh, we're in sync. <laughs> Bye, guys. Change out. As always, peace.